16.7b Work Problems, Two Unknown Times. Be sure to clearly identify who is the variable or, in other words, the unknown. In example one, we have Tony who does a job in 16 hours less time than Marissa and they can do it together in 15 hours. So we have Tony and we have Marissa. Okay, Tony, we don't really know how long he does outside of it's 15 or 16 hours less than um, Marissa, so he's going to be x minus 16 and Marissa will be x. So we have 1 out of x minus 16 plus 1 out of x equal to 1 out of 15. So that means we're going to multiply our, by our LCD which is going to be 15x times x minus 16. So we're going to get 15x plus 15 times x minus 16 equal to x times x minus 16. So we get 15x plus 15x minus, let's see, 15 times 16 is going to give us 240 equal to x squared minus 16x. So we combine like terms here, we get 30x minus 240 equal to x squared minus 16x. Let's get everything on one side now. So we'll subtract 30x and add 240. Okay, so now we have 0 equal to x squared minus 46x plus 240. And let's see, I think we're going to throw this into the quadra quadratic formula. So we're going to have x equal to 46 plus or minus the square root of 46 squared minus 4 times 1 times 240 all over 2 times 1. Okay, and that's going to give us x equal to 46 plus or minus the square root of 1156 all over 2. We take the square root of that and we get 34. So we have x equal to 46 plus or minus 34, whoops, supposed to be 4, all over 2. Now, if we do 46 minus 34, we're only going to get 12, and if you take 12 minus 16, you're going to get a negative number, so we don't want to do the subtraction part. We want to do 46 plus our 34, which is going to give us 80. So we have 80 over 2, which is going to give us 40. What that means is, let me go ahead and write this here. When we come back up here, we have Tony, which would be 40 minus 16, which is going to give us 24. So he takes 24 hours, and Marissa is going to take 40 hours to do the same job. So how that's how long it'll take them to do the job. Let's look at example two now. We have Alex and we have Hillary. And it says that Alex can complete the project in 21 hours less than Hillary, so we're going to call Hillary X. And that means Alex would be X minus 
21. So what our equation looks like then is 1 over x minus 21 plus 1 over x and they complete the job together in 1 out of 10 hours. So we're going to multiply by our LCD which is going to be 10x times x minus 21. So we're going to get 10x plus 10 times x minus 21 equal to x times x minus 21. So now we're going to have 10x plus 10x minus 210 equal to x squared minus 21x. So now we have 20x minus 210 equal to x squared minus 21x. We want to get everything on one side, so we're going to subtract 20x and add 210. Okay, so now we have 0 equal to our x squared minus 41x plus 210. Okay, we're going to throw this in the quadratic formula also. So we're going to have, whoops, not 0, x equal to 41 plus or minus the square root of 41 squared minus 4 times 1 times 210 all over 2 times 1 and we're going to get that x equals 41 plus or minus the square root of 841 all over 2 so x is going to equal 41 plus or minus 29 all over 2. Now just like we had before, if we take 41 minus 29, we're not going to get enough to subtract, so we're going to add 41 plus 29, and we're going to get, this is 70 over 2, which is 35. So now let's go look at our original equation, and we put 35 minus 21, we're going to get 14 hours for Alex, and Hillary will be 35 hours, and so there is our solution.